as you know, we'll be shooting flu liner up, um, kind of the general process of what we're doing. We'll fly first piece, it'll go down, it'll bear on the scaffold, sec take the second piece up, hold it with the grain, weld it, do that process over, over and again three or four times. We got a lot of people on site. Um, MCL has our, our crew on site. Um, we have a, a large crew of MMC from their HVAC division, um, welders, general laborers. Um, they got a small army out here helping out. This is to accommodate the new steam boilers for the boiler plant upgrades. Uh, this is a, we had to reline them due to sizing and the um, condensate that comes out of the new boilers is a corrosive, so it had to be stainless steel lined. We're gonna take this thing vertical, so we probably got, I don't know, about five-ish minutes before we'll go up. Copy that. So tentatively what our plan is right now is we're going to bring the other two, drop them over here and go tomorrow. It's just, we're hitting like 30 mile, almost 30 mile hour gas. Unfortunately, we, um, we're over our threshold for our wind allowances on the crane. And in addition to that, it was too windy to keep the pieces together while we weld them in place. So we had to make the, the call to um, pause yesterday and then come back today when we have a better wind speed. There's been a lot that's gone into um, this event, a lot of coordination. Um, we obviously, we take up the entire dock for the, the hospital, so a lot of coordination with their deliveries and their facilities team. It's exciting to be part of this. It's, it's a little sigh of relief to be done with it now. Thank you.